Hello, Ninja Koopa here, and if you're watching this, then it's probably because your computer isn't recognizing your Elgato capture device. I have the older Elgato uh, Capture HD, but this should work for the HD60 Plus S, all those as well. So I have the Elgato Game Capture Studio up, my Elgato is plugged in, but my computer still isn't recognizing my Elgato. I'm getting this no capture devices found message. One reason for this is you're missing the Elgato video driver, or your driver is outdated. To test this, make sure your Elgato is connected to your computer. That's very important. If it's not plugged in, it won't work. And then open your device manager on your computer. Locate the section for sound, video, and game controllers, then expand it. You're, and the driver you're looking for should say something like game capture or, or Elgato video, something to indicate that it's, it's video. Um, if you only see the Elgato sound capture, then this is your problem. And as you see here, I only see the Elgato sound capture. So that means my computer is missing the video driver. Let's go to get it. Next, we're gonna to go to elgato.com slash downloads, link in the description. And we're gonna select the Elgato we have. I have the, let's see, I, again, I have the older, where is it, legacy. I have the older Game Capture HD, um, but it would be the same for if you had the 60, 60S or whatever. And then we're going to locate where it says find hardware and drivers here. Okay. And then again, you're going to look for the, oh, brought me down to the bottom. And again, you're going to locate the Elgato you have. Um, I'm using Windows 10. If you're using a Mac, then I, I don't know what your problem could be. Uh, if you're using an older Windows, like seven or eight, then they also have drivers. Just pick whichever one you have for whatever uh, version of Windows you, you're using. So again, I have Windows 10 and I have the Elgato Game Capture HD. So we're going to download install and then click to install. Okay, now that we have the driver installed, let's go back to the device manager. And what you might need to do at this point is, I think you gotta unplug your Elgato and plug it back in. Now that's gonna cause the device manager to, to refresh. That's good, that's what we want. Okay, and let's check. Again, go back to sound, video, and, and game controllers. And look at that. Now we have the Game Capture HD driver that, we're, that we were missing. Um, oh, it refreshed again. Okay, and again, your, yours might be named slightly different, um, and you may or may not need to restart your computer, but at this point, we're basically done. Let's make our way back to the, uh, the Elgato Capture Studio. And you may or may not need to restart your, uh, your Capture Studio here, but you see now we, instead of the you know, no devices found message, we get the no signal, which is exactly what we're looking for. The Elgato is working. We're just not putting anything through it. So this is exactly what we want. All right. I hope that was helpful. Koopa out.